Hey guys, welcome back to another video here at Cool Prince today. Uh, I have an order from a customer for two Mickey Mouse shirts, two designs, and each design has a minimum of four colors. Uh, and they just want one shirt each. And I'm not going to set up eight screens just for two shirts. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use heat transfer vinyl. I'll be using the new power heat press that I just uh, received, the one that I showed you in the unboxing video. And we're going to see how it, how it works. Okay, so first we need to do is we're going to do the Mickey shirt, which is a large Gildan. I'm going to go ahead and press it to get all the moisture out, and that way I, I'll have a center line to line up my artwork. They did send a Teflon sheet with this press too, which I thought was kind of neat. So that way now we got it creased in the center. This one is a different than my other one. My other one was a eight, eight, eight to a different, eight different things you can use on it, and it was a swing press. This one, this one is not. So I'm gonna get used to putting the shirt in. I think I'm gonna do it like this. That's how I'm gonna do it. Okay. All right. I'm gonna line up the artwork and I'll be right back. All right. Let's start off here with with black. Maybe I'll go this way. Definitely be careful with that. We're just going to press this for a few seconds just to get it to tack up. Okay, this particular stuff is cool peel. Sweetening it, I cut There his tails together now. Let's see. Bear with me. I'll be right back. All right, let's do the yellow feet. A couple seconds again, and at the end we'll cure it to full time, the full uh, 30 se 35 seconds. Pretty good, guys. We'll be red. Okay, red's next. spring is kind of hard to get off there though.
do white next. Okay, let's press this white. One thing I like about it is you got to use a lot of force to pry this up. So you have to on the bottom while you lift the plate. Last one now, the tan face. We'll do it for 10 seconds and press the whole thing for the whole entire time needed. They didn't have a light tan that I really needed for the face, so I had to go a little darker. Hopefully, the customer will think it's okay. If not, they may get some free shirts. What do you think? Dang it! Came up, but I'll fix it. See? It's alright, I'll fix it later. Let's do the small mini now. Her whole family's going to uh, Disney World, so she ordered uh, 14 other shirts, which I already did those. And those again, those took a bunch of screens too, because they had different names and all that on there. But I, I ended up condensing all the names onto one one screen and just adjusted her print. Worked okay, it's just time consuming.
Okay, let's go on with Mickey. Or Minnie, I'm sorry. Let's go on with Minnie. I guess I'm going to keep putting it shirt head first because it's a little easier. Next, we'll do our shoes. Yeah, we'll do our shoes next. See that black on black. All right, let's do it. Got to make sure the parts fit in there correctly, or it's not gonna it's gonna mess up the whole thing. This is a lot of work cutting all this stuff out and weeding it. to the mix here. Doesn't look too bad, but I still gotta miss, fix the freaking shoes again on this one too. The yellow, the yellow is just weak. All right, let's fix Mickey's shoes and then we'll go on. Let's go ahead and do the last press on Mickey here. I'm not gonna go 35 seconds. I think that's too much. There's gonna be another 10 over the top. I think we'll, we'll be good then. I think that yellow. The reason why the yellow didn't stick quite right is because it's a cool peel. The lady told me it was hot peel looking where I bought it from. But.
right, here we go. There's Mickey. So it says, I don't do matching shirts. And then her shirt says, I do. So. Okay, one thing that's missing I think I need to do is she's missing her tongue. Missing, a, missing her tongue it looks kind of weird, so I'm going to have to do that real quick off camera. One more press and we're done. I do the last press to smooth out all, any lines that the, the cover sheets may, may leave in the actual vinyl. Just kind of smooths it over. Well, all in all, I said it's pretty good first uh, time using the press. I like it. There's the finished product. There's the Mickey or mini shirt. Okay, there's that one. And there's that one.